bitch, no underwear. 2020, gon' pull up an egg, yeah. Bitch, I'm the wave, you can go home. Uber, Uber everywhere, yeah. Take my bitch everywhere. We be getting money everywhere, yeah. They don't even know. They be throwing shade everywhere. Hey guys, it's me Johannes. Today I have a new makeup tutorial for you guys. It is a festival inspired makeup look. If you guys want to use this at a party or a music festival or um, any special event, you just want to look a little bit more extra than the normal makeup look, you guys can proceed to watch this tutorial. So this year I'm attending It's The Ship Music Festival. It is the largest music festival at sea and it's their fifth anniversary this year. Year. So um, I'm gonna be really really excited because I'm gonna be catching Big Shack. If you guys know, if you guys don't know, Big Shack is, you know, it's the the thing goes crap, pa 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 pa, skip skip pa pa, br boom boom boom. It's two plus two plus two plus. So last year I did a lot of things on the ship. I went on the water slide. I did bowling. I went to the arcade. I even did the zip line like next to the boat, sort of above the ocean. That was super cool. So I'm really, really excited. It's just around the corner. So this is the makeup look that I'll be wearing. So if you guys want to know how to get this look, please keep on watching. Alright now, <clears throat> first off, I already did my brows. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you guys know that I already did my brows. And if you guys hear like a really loud noise, it's my mom watching Produce 101. Okay, since I already did my brows, I'm going to prime my face with the infallible mattifying base. This is from L'Oreal. I mean, if you guys have any recommendations, please comment below because I'm always up to try out new products. Um, but yeah, I've been using this for like quite some time and it just feels really nice. Next up, I'm going to be putting on foundation. Um, my favorite, favorite foundation to use for events or festivals or whatever. Um, for special occasions, I love to use Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation, the stick version. I have like two of these. Um, I'm in the shade 123 or Y365. I really really like this because I like how it's not too matte so it looks like real skin af like after a few hours because after putting like um, powder and stuff it still looks real nice so what I'm most excited about for it's the ship is that they have like a... I'm sorry, my earrings are so loud. Or is it just next to my ears? So what I'm really excited about is the ship is that they have night galas. And I'm going to be dressing super extra for that. I'm going to get like a dress and everything. Um, I'm going to be doing my hair and my makeup. Because they have like really fancy gala dinners. Which I'm super excited about. Because I usually have nowhere to go to wear like really nice dresses. Because like... Where, where do you go in KL that you can dress up really nicely in like a gown and stuff so I'm really excited for that and I'm also really excited because all of my friends are going so it, we're just gonna have like a super great time see I just love how it looks like skin skin you know sorry I had to like turn the exposure down a little bit so you guys can see what actually is going on then my face looking just super white okay now let's move on to concealer so my favorite concealer at the moment that i love 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 to use um that has super full 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 coverage is the all-nighter waterproof it's waterproof okay so festivals and stuff this is great because it's waterproof i use this for um Good Vibes Festival, I use this a lot to cut my brow, like to fake a cut brow, so this is really good. Um, 
I use this a lot for my crease as well. But this dries super super fast, so you have to work really quick with it. So, and that's what I'm gonna do. I use the shade Medium Light Neutral. Um, I have like three shades in this. Sometimes I use it to um, make it even more brighter and stuff. But I love this stuff because it stays and it's super full coverage. And every time I ask my friends to try this out, they actually end up buying this. So, yeah, you guys should give it a go. Um, but one thing though, it's mm, it's quite drying. It's not super drying, but but don't put too much. Don't bake with this. You can't. It's it'll be too dry. So. You just set it with powder and then put some setting spray then it's good to go. Do not bake with it because it will look really dry and you have to work really fast with it. You see, I look so awake. This, now that we have a perfect canvas, we gotta set it. Gotta set the canvas. Okay, so my favorite powders to use is the Laura Mercier translucent powder that everybody uses and also the Pore Professional. I like to have this in my bag. I use this when I just finished um, putting my concealer and foundation down but this is what I put in my bag throughout the day what I just like use because it comes with a brush and you just like twist this and pour it and then you just and then you put it all over your face. This literally your pores don't exist when you put this on so I love that shit. I love it. So we're good. Me and my friend Jazel always raves about it. Oh yeah, Jazel's going to is this shit as well. I'm super excited for that. Cause like all of my friends will be there. All my college friends, my best friends, my childhood friends. So it's gonna be fun. We're just gonna have so much fun and chill and just relax. I like to use a sponge, a damp sponge to put powder under my eyes and wherever I look super shiny, like here. And then, and I get a powder brush and just take whatever that's left and powder the rest on my face so that it sets and stays all day. If you are wondering why is my earrings like this side to blah this side to blah it's because it's style, okay? You don't say, hey Johannes, your earrings to blah blah line, you do a curse, so whatever it's 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 the style okay it's the fashion it's the fashion i'm gonna be doing my eyes now it's gonna be purple um, i'm gonna be doing like a really simple look if i can find my brushes what is this the kat von d metal matte eyeshadow palette and i'm gonna be using the shade silk which is this one and i'm just gonna put it all over my eyes like all over like all over why is there so many loud noises today? Like, why is everyone being rude? So yeah, I'm just doing a wash on my lid. Legit, my mom, my mom punya video is super loud. Kejap eh, I have to go baba. Mom, can you lower down your music? I'm doing a video. Thanks. Kids, am I right? Where was I? Okay. Silk. Silk lid. Just put it all over. This is my Jeffree Star Androgyny palette. It is very loved. So, um, wait, let me just brush my eyelashes for a while. They're so annoying. Wait, where's my... <laughs> okay. Okay, now everything's okay. Now I can get my shit together. Beauty girls be like, I'm gonna be taking the color charm and just putting it in my inner corners and just packing it all in. Okay. Like that. Now we are going to take the what is this? An eyeliner. It's <laughs> I'm so bad at this. Okay, so this is the ColourPop Cream Gel liner. It is in the shade Punch. It is yellow. Oh, and it's a little broken. I'm gonna be putting this here. Here. This app. 
I just put myself in the eye. Okay, um, I'm gonna be. I'm so bad at this. Like that. Now your Thai mata looks like it's the kencing. <laughs> now we are going to proceed with the face. So what I did earlier before I started this video, I took masking tape and a blade. I literally like took a masking tape and a blade and just cut out like a diamond piece. And I already did it. It doesn't have to be perfect, okay? Um, Maybe you can pre-do this and then bring it to the festival or whatever, wherever you want to go. Um, I cut it out already and I just sticked it here. Like this. Just press it down. Make sure it's on there real good. I'm going to be taking the Huda palette, the Man Eater color, which is this red looking one. I'm going to be taking a tiny brush. I'm just gonna pat on top very gently. Take this Sweet Cheeks palette from NYX and open it. <sighs> okay, and then I'm just gonna take this shade and just put it on top and just fade it out and blend. And then I'm going back in and just lightly tapping man eater on the edges okay so once it looks like that i'm just gonna peel it off and then it will look like that don't worry if it's not clean because you can always use a concealer and just clean it away i'm just gonna brush it We're just going to peel it again and ta-da! One side then you can continue to do it on the other side if you want. I'm just going to do it on one side. And then I'm just going to be taking the blush palette from NYX again and then I'm going to put on some blush. Okay, so now I'm going to be taking the heavy metal um, liner, glitter liner. Um, by Urban Decay, it's in the shade Cat Call, and then I'm just gonna put random sparkles. So now that I look like a strawberry, I can proceed to do my lips. I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Mademoiselle Lipstick in the shade Candy Venom. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys like this video, give this video a big thumbs up. Also comment down below on what other makeup tutorials or whatever video you guys want to see next. So if you guys are not subscribed to this channel yet, I am disappointed. Because why are you watching this video if you are not subscribed to me? So just subscribe. It's free. Turn on the notification bell so you guys do not miss on any of my videos. I hope you guys have a beautiful day ahead. Thank you so much for watching my video. I love you guys. Bye.